or go to math.com and looking at some calculus let's go down to implicit differentiation and click on we want 2 dash 2 to come up so we have uh, x to the fifth times y is equal to 8 and we're doing implicit differentiation so we're going to be taking the derivative of, of that x to the fifth times y is equal to 8 <laughs> x to the fifth times y is equal to 8 so we're asked to find y prime and I'm always adding this most of the time they're probably going to ask you to find dy over dx okay. either or doesn't matter um, alright so we're going to be using uh, the product rule is really what this is um, let's take the derivative of the first function x to the fifth and so that's 5 x to the fourth and we then write y write the second function plus then write the first function let's rewrite then we take the derivative of y and that's one but then when we take the derivative of y we gotta write y prime and of course the derivative of a constant is zero okay now if we were asked to find dy over dx we would be writing dy over dx right here I guess that's worth noting x to the fifth times y prime equals so we take this part over to the right hand side and it becomes negative 5x to the fourth y and then we will oop, don't forget that take this guy diagonally down and x to the fifth down here in the denominator. Now what we'll want to do is we need to simplify this down so we have y prime is equal to so we have 4x's in the numerator we have 5x's in the denominator so we can cancel some x's out over x so we're only left with 1x down here in the denominator, right? So we have 4 up here, 5 down here, cancel 4 out, and cancel 4 out down here in the denominator. And there we go. So we got uh, y prime is equal to negative 5y over x. Negative 5y over x. Negative 5y. it is. Alright, come by and practice and I'll see you there.